Hey, I've made this video because a number of users were coming to Spooky2 through Bacana Labs and it was their first time using the Spooky2 software. They had a number of questions about how to use it. So what we're going to do is highlight a couple of settings. First we're going to start with the general preset and this requires the Radiant device to be connected to either Out1 or Out2 on the XM generator or on the Spooky Boost 3.0 board. First we select the install presets here which come preloaded with the latest softwares. We select Spooky Radionics General. And this one is preloaded with Schumann Resonance 7.83 Hz. So we can go straight away and start using the device by clicking Control. And I have these selected to always overwrite for a single generator. If you have multiple generators, it is best to remove that overwrite function there. So this is the generator control box. We click that and it loads the frequency of Schumann resonance. We click start. It loads the frequency into the generator. And the generator activates. And this will run on a loop until you decide to stop it, which we do here. Now I will show you the BN settings or healing mode, which is an increased amplitude and voltage, it gives more power to the device. And first, we erase this here. We go back to presets and we select the healing preset. Now this doesn't come preloaded with Schumann so you can add any frequencies you like uh, for instance if you were trying to work on abscess you can select these ones here or you can type anything into the box and it will display a whole list of frequencies to use So with the BN setting, the device is unplugged from the general ports, out one or out two, and connected to BN on the Spooky Boost 3.0. So you need the boost board to make the BN work. We go back to control. It loads all new frequencies. Click start. And it runs through a generator. And that will also run on loop until you decide to stop it. I would like to point out here that plant growth also works on the general preset settings. So that means it is connected to out1 or out2, not the BM port. So for an updated version of the software, we will make this known in the description here. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.